actually a name given to me by one of my best friends. Uh, we was doing some gospel stuff back in the day, and then he just said, hey, uh, here's a necklace, and it says, his will. And I said, ah, that's so good. So I just took it and ran. <laughs> Now that you said that, yeah, yeah. Right, with my name and I'm his, so you know everything. Kind so of what, kind of, what kind of music is it that you play? It's gospel music, uh, I call it R&G, rhythm and gospel. Mm -hmm. So it's like it has the R&B flavor to it, but it's uh, inspirational music, music with a message I call it. Is this your first year at Springboard? Yes it is. And how did you find out about Springboard? Um, actually through Reverb Nation, I was uh, just applying to a bunch of different things and Three in the morning, I got an email saying, Hey, man, you chose to be one of the artists. And I said, Oh, okay. But I had been looking at it before, you know, so this is like someone I'd like to try to be a part of. And I was able to do it. So, so you heard about it? There's been some buzz or something? Yeah, I heard a little bit about it over the internet and, and a little bit more on Reverb Nation. So, so what do you know about your Um, Basically, that is just like a, um, you know, like a music conference, but it's uh, more of you know, kind of helping the independent artists how to, how they get you know through different things from marketing and getting the music together and just kind of like a networking um, uh, conference to where you can be able to learn some more stuff and apply different things. Is it different than other kind of music that you Um, for, I have, this is like one of my first ones, but from you know looking at other ones and uh, kind of doing research on the other ones, um, I think it, this is probably a little bit more different because it's a little bit more personal, I'd say. You know, it's, um, a lot of the other ones, sometimes you don't get to get that one-on-one -on -one with so many, 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 many people, but this one is, I like this one, you kind of get what you need to get, and you get to talk to them, because I like how they have the breakout sessions, you know, after they do the panels, and they go over to the next room, and then you can sit down one-on-one -on -one and talk with them, kind of pick their brain, so that's definitely good. So what have you experienced as far as the campus going? Um, so far, just... <laughs> I'll probably process everything later, but uh, just a lot of information. Um, talked to a couple of lawyers I got, because, um, uh, you know, the big thing now is the streaming. So they was talking about how the royalties and all this kind of stuff is going on. So there was a good discussion on that. So I was able to go across to the room to one of the breakout sessions and then actually get some more information um, on, you know, a little bit more royalty information and just how you're getting paid and found out some stuff like I might have some money out there because yeah. some songs being played and I have to go and get it, so. <laughs> Nobody wants to give it to you. you exactly. We got to go and get it. Of course, they're going to hold that back, but we have to go and seek it out, so. Now, the name Springboard kind of implies kind of, you know, that, that jump down, that bounce to your, to your whatever, your career, your person. How, how do you think that, that what you learn here today is going to affect you going forward? Um, definitely in a positive way because I've learned some things just just by the first half of the day. Um, of what I can do, like for one thing, sound exchange. Uh, they were talking about um, that's how you get paid. For, I didn't know nothing about that. Really, I may have heard it, but I didn't really hear about it like that. It's where you you know you apply and, and you get that extra money that may be sitting out there like they have like millions of dollars waiting and nobody's claiming it. So you know that's something I've learned and. Just to be able to uh, learn different ways to market yourself, uh, they talked about the um, different campaigns and um, things like that. Um, just a lot of marketing. That's the big, big thing. You're starting off as a new artist and coming up, you want to learn ways to how can you market it. Talking about uh, YouTube and uh, how that's a big platform. You know, getting the views and things like that. How that turns into revenue. As you see, there's a lot of. Uh, people out on the um, YouTube, they're getting like twenty, thirty thousand dollars a month from the advertisers that's paying them and because of the views they get. So basically you get a lot of views, they don't want to advertise there, they want to pay you for that. So it's just it's just a wealth of stuff. So, <laughs> so uh have you spoken with Barry? Um, I had a little chance to uh, speak with him briefly, a little bit through email. Then here, I uh, talking about he's busy bouncing around. I haven't got a one-on-one -on -one with him uh, to, uh, quite yet, but uh, from talking with him through email, I got to talk a little bit there. Um, when, 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 when you applied, was it a difficult process to become a part of the spring board? No, not at all. Um, at Reverb Nation, they have something where, mm -hmm. as you send out your, uh, what is it, your RPK, yeah. and you send it to these different, it's just a submit, 
and you submit a song thing, and then they then they look over your um, RPK or whatnot, and they, you have different music and stats and things like that, and then you know it's just you just submit and then and then we'll let things fall as they may. So, and that's what happened, and then I was able to get chosen to be here. So. And what do you what do you uh, what what again? You play the gospel kind of gospel, yeah. And and it's kind of you said it was R and D R and G R and G yeah rhythm and gospel. Like you may have heard of there's R and P like rhythm and praise. You have your contemporary different things. So I said let me call out a little bit something different and go with R and G rhythm and gospel. So that way it's uh, you still oh, that sounds good. But then it's music with a message. You go home with something that you can actually meditate on. You know, whether it's something else, you know, all the time. So it's just, you know, just give it an option. I don't try to beat the Bible in people's face or anything like that. I just uh, call the music with a message. Um, just give them something as an alternative, but you still get your same, um, the feeling that you get from music. And, but it just has a positive message to it. And what day are you going to play? Uh, that will be Sunday, I believe, be, um, in the 5.30 to 7.30 slot. All right, looking forward to it. Yes, definitely. You have, a, you have a big following of fans when I come out? Uh, trying to grow grow that. So uh, hopefully uh, I'm still getting there. So what I put out, you know, try to do as much as I can do. And uh, we'll see. <laughs> you think that Springboard is going to live up to its name and you're going to get a bounce out? Um, I think so. Um, you know, it's definitely high exposure. Um, just, and just networking with different artists. You know, you start networking with other artists and stuff. And they start inviting you to do things. So I've already met, you know, people, and so it's just looking, it's looking pretty good right now. Thank you for your time. Hey, thank you. All right. All right.